Okay. Hey, y'all. So, I just wanted to make this quick video, and I'm going to do it as quickly as possible, about fixing a problem that I've been having that's been very, very frustrating with Spotify, where the songs certain songs wouldn't play and even the album art wouldn't show it would just be blank and nothing would happen when i clicked them and i thought that the solution was to uninstall Spot spotify and then reinstall it and when i did that all of my favorite songs were gone all of my playlists were empty even playlists that were made by spotify were empty and i searched and searched and searched for hours and could find nothing to fix it i just gave up thought maybe the server was down or something anyway tldr is that i found a solution that worked for me and it appears to be working for a lot of people but i found that in the last three days this has been heavily searched and no one's made a video on it yet to make it easier for you to do because it was so difficult for me to figure out how to do this at first because maybe i'm just stupid or something but um there was a lot of problems happening so I'm just going to make this quick video to show you how to do it uh, quickly and easily so this post here um, by heaven kinder um, is in one of these Spotify forum things this is the solution that worked for me I'm gonna walk you through it real quick and I'm gonna copy this because this is exactly what I had and I already fixed mine so um, you're gonna go to you know Windows Explorer or whatever and you're going to find your local disk, go to Windows, and you're going to find System32, even though I have a 64-bit computer or whatever, don't worry about that. You're going to find the drivers folder right here. And then what I had to do is I had to find, I had to search for the hosts file, blah, 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 open file location. There it is, and it's a generic file type. And so when you click to open it, just uh, select Notepad or any other text editor. And what you're going to get is this. And now at the bottom here, there's all these. Um, I have no idea what these are. I'm not a tech genius, all right? But I had a line down here that, that looked like this. It said spclient.wg.spotify.com. And so what you have to do is you have to delete that. Now, where I ran into an issue is when I tried to save this. Like, I just hit Control S to try and save it, and it would tell me that I didn't have permission to save in this folder. So what you actually have to do is um, go to... So this is in the Etc. folder. So I would right-click the Etc. folder, click Properties, and then under security the security tab you want to edit permissions and you'll click on the administrator you have to be on an administrator account to do this and this is just you know my pc so i'm the administrator and so you click that and then you click full control and make sure all the boxes on allow are checked for you except for this one which i can't seem to do for some reason and this is on Windows 7, by the way. I don't use Windows 10. And then you click Apply. Uh, yes, and OK. And then you should be able to save this just by hitting Control-S. And it'll just save the file as it was. And like they say in this post, uh, if you can't save it, even after doing what I just showed you, uh, close the folder, reopen the folder, the etc. folder, um, close the file and reopen the file, redelete the Spotify line, and then do a save as and give it a different name, delete the old one, and then change the name back to just hosts. And then you can reopen Spotify and everything should be there. Um, and one of the things that I learned about this issue, personally for me, is that I used to pay for Spotify Premium. And when I stopped paying for Premium, I never got ads back. And I always thought that that was weird. And for months and months, I never had ads, even though I was on a Spotify free account. And now I've noticed that after doing this, that the ads are back. So I'm thinking where the issue was happening um, is that... 
that line in that file was the old Spotify premium thingamajiggy, I don't know the term, um, telling the Spotify system not to give any ads, but because I was on a free account, it was conflicting the app. And so the app, when you click play on a song, the app was trying to play an ad, but was telling itself it couldn't, and there was all this conflicting going on uh, um, with the system. So I think that's what the issue was, if that helps anybody for some reason. Um, that's just why I wanted to make this quick video. The thing that I had the biggest issue with was trying to save this, um, freaking file in here because it kept saying I didn't have permission and that I needed permission. So, like I said, all you have to do is just change your permissions in the properties of the etc. folder under the security tab, edit, and just make sure you checkbox to allow full control for your administrator account. And then you should be able to save the file with your changes to it. And that should be it. If you have any further questions or anything, feel free to ask in the comments down below. I'll do my best to answer. I'm not exactly on YouTube all the time. I just didn't see anybody else made a video for this. And so I thought I'd do it to make it easy for you. And uh, that's it. See you.